Chartered for me means an invitation to open yourself up to external scrutiny, not just about what you do, your technical specialism, but more importantly about how you do it. You need to be very clear about what your motives are, what your intent is, and this is an opportunity to be provoked to think about that, to be deliberate about that, and to be able to articulate that clearly with your clients. Our industry contains many different flavours of management consultants, and that's very difficult if you're a buyer of those services, because how do you know to choose between them? This is one of the ways that protects the buyers and the users of management consulting services, and that makes it half the balanced equation. The other half is around making sure our clients are sufficiently informed to buy what they need and to use us in the best way possible. Making sure we protect the people buying our services by differentiating between those who offer management consulting is very important. We need to make sure that we're transparent in what we're doing and that we're able to, to show the value that we're bringing and that we're clear about that. At the moment, we're part of quite a select group. It's still a differentiator in the marketplace. So without a doubt, Charter definitely reflects positively on the firm and the firm is definitely finding advantages to having chartered consultants in the team not only in terms of the frameworks that they'll be able to bid for work on, but for me, as a practicing consultant, it's another way to have a different conversation with our clients and making clients more intelligent purchasers and more intelligent users of management consulting services.